The NEC is the primary source for electrical standards in the United States and contains guidelines for electrical use in all locations containing hazardous materials. The NAC divides hazardous materials areas into three classes, each with its own electrical specifications. The three NEC hazmat area classes are Class 1, where electricity could ignite airborne flammable gases and vapors or cause them to explode. Class 2, where airborne combustible dust is present. And Class 3, where ignitable materials are present but are not airborne in sufficient quantities to catch fire. Let's take a look at Class 1 sites. Class 1 areas include refineries, chemical manufacturers, and even hospitals. These sites contain flammable gases and vapors which can be ignited by unshielded electrical devices. In spite of these dangers, there are safe ways to work with electricity in these areas. One of the most effective is through the use of engineering controls, technological means, that reduce workplace hazards. Since all electrical devices from large machinery to pocket flashlights contain circuitry, it is critical that you use approved equipment for the area you are working in. Electrical devices with moving parts such as mechanical relays can produce arcs. This makes them unsuitable for Class 1 sites. For this reason, Class 1 sites need to be equipped with intrinsically safe systems.